we're going to paint the, the background. We're going to choose three different colors. Start with the darkest. We're going to do start with the black one, and then with the blue, and then with the white one. All right. So she's going to start first with this one. So she's going to try if she can. She can open this one. She has to. She needs assistance. But she's going to add, try to put the black here on the top of the canvas, all right? Tú no puedes poner poquito arriba del canvas, por favor. Ya, a little bit, solamente poquito. Ya. There you go. Thank you, gracias. So now we're going to add the blue one. Ahora vamos a agregar el azul, ¿está bien? Mm -hmm. Let me see if she can open this one. Si lo puedes abrir, si no, me avisa, ¿está bien? Okay. All right. So now you're going to add it in this part of the canvas, like here, like from here all the way here. You're going to make a little spot. Vas a hacer lo mismo poquito abajo, pero con okay. poquito así, okay. así como botitas, ¿vale? Poquito más. Si no puedes, usa las dos manos. Si te lastimas o algo, dime para que no te lastimas. Sí, vas a hacer lo mismo en todos lugares varios diferentes. Si puedes, hacerlo en todo el canvas. That one. And now we're going to add the white one. All right, the lightest color. Vamos a agregar el blanco, lo puedes abrir. Can you please open it? And this one, you're going to add it just below, okay? So, en esta, esta parte, nomás lo vas a agregar de la mitad para abajo So now she's going to use the whitest brush Puedes usar la brocha más angosta Esta? Mm -hmm. okay. And now she's going to try to paint it going to the horizontal way from right to left Alright, so from the top going to the to the Pues ahora hacerlo horizontalmente de derecha a izquierda, comenzando de la parte superior para abajo inferior. Está bien. Are you feeling any type of pain? ¿Has sentido algo de dolor? En los hombros. En los hombros. Si tiene que descansar, puede descansar. Está bien. There you go. See, she's doing a great job, right? Muy bien, bien hecho. So now we're, going, we're just going to wait until it gets dry. Ahorita muy bien. Vamos a esperar que esté que está bien. All right, so the paint, uh, the paint is already dry. So now we're going to start doing the, the trunk of the tree, all right? So the, for this time, we're going to choose the brown color, all right? But, this time my mom, she has never drawn paint up to me before, so she's, we're going to use my phone. So she's going to see this picture, this drawing, so she can figure out how to paint it here on the canvas. So she's just going to help her in a visual way. So this time we're going to add the painting, the brown painting, here in the disposable plate. I don't have a plate for this one. Alright, vas a agregar la pintura café, esta en el aquí en el plato de ese chat. She chose this brush, me guarded it. She chose this one. I just want to see if she's going to be able to hold the brush. So we're going to practice first on this canvas so she can try to paint it here first. If not, I made some adapted equipment, metal paper, uh, so we can put it on the brushes for some, for this one, not for this one, like for this one, so she can hold the brush more easier, if she needs it. Alright, 
Y me puedes dar un poco de pintura en el brush y puedes agregar un poquito de pintura ahí para que podamos saber si tú puedes sostener la brush y poder pintar algo aquí, ¿está bien? A ver si se te hace fácil. ¿Sí está bien? Sí. All right, it's fine. So we don't need that adapter equipment. All right. So you can continue. Ahora sí puedes dibujar el tronco. We're going to paint the trunk. The trunk. How are you feeling? ¿Cómo se está sintiendo? Bien. Bien. No dolor. Un poco. Un poquito. Yes, a little bit. She issues a smaller brush, so now we're going to see if she's going to be able to hold, hold that one. So now we're going to practice with that one. Puede practicar con ese en esta en este canvas, por favor. Si va a Si va a All right. So this time we're going to use one of the adapted equipment that I made with paper and tape, so we can hold it. And I also add in this part of the brush a little bit of tape, so the paper doesn't go to the other way, okay? Let me see. Can you please try with this time? Voy a tratarlo esta vez, a ver si funciona. Si la hace mejor? Sí. All right. Much better. It's looking good. Okay, yeah. Listo, she's ready. All right. So we're not going to need this one anymore. So now we're going to, she's going to paint the leaves of the tree. We're going to start first with the darkest color, with this one, with this green, and then, but we're going to use Q-tips. Because instead of using a brush, Q-tips is going to help her to paint a tree that leaves the tree easier and the fastest way. All right. So you see, I use like I use nine Q-tips. I just take them all together, and so she's going to try to use the green paint, <laughs> try to put it in the canvas, and then she's going to try to paint around the tree. This one she's going to use the lightest color that we want and she's going to add to the palette to the plate, little plate, and this one she's going to use the opposite side of the cutes, okay? Pero vamos a agregar el color verde clarito, agregarlo al plato y usar el lado opuesto de los cutes. So this time she has uh, been the lips, so she, now we're, she's going to be the, the apple, and she's going to use red apple color, alright? So can you please add the red color, the red, um, color to the plate, please? And this time, instead of using multiple Q-tips, we're just going to use one. 